All right, we got a polynomial over a polynomial, so we can use our rule that we can just look at the degree, or if you like the rule where you just take the leading term, that's the same thing. This limit has to be the same thing as the limit as x goes to negative infinity of x cubed over x squared, which simplifies down to x going to negative infinity of x. And if x goes to negative infinity, then x goes to negative infinity. So the answer up here is negative infinity. Using our um, just the, the degree rule, the degree of the top is bigger, which means that the top is going to grow bigger than the bottom, and it's either going to go way up or way down. So you got to figure out if it's positive or negative, and if you plug in a huge negative number, the top is negative, but the bottom is positive. So a negative over positive, negative over positive, and a negative. So that's why it's going to negative infinity as well.